everyone, Baldywagger55 here, and today I'm going to be doing a brand new series called Baldywagger55 Reviews, where I'll be reviewing books, toys, and figurines. Now, the first thing I want to review is this Mythical Monsters book that my mom picked up at her school from a kid that donated. So let's go ahead and start it up. Mythical Monsters. Mythical Monsters, the scariest creatures from legends, books, and movies. And Chris McNabb made this. He's actually a really good one. And by the way, this is Scholastic. So if y'all want to read this and you're like... Um, a kid, you can read this. Okay, so now we have the contents. Let's get started. Here's the introduction. I'm going to go over these real quick. The Chimera. I don't know how to say this, so please don't get mad. Dracula. Godzilla. Leviathan. Chupacabra. Loch Ness Monster. Bigfoot. Gorgon. King Kong. Dunkalisha. Graylin. Kraken. Alright, so let's get on to the first one. The black dog. So this is a black dog. Um let me start off with something that's a little scary, but like not too scary. Um Yeah. And then if you go over here they have like little lines pointing to all the um, things and parts of the bodies. Okay, so here's the story if you want to go ahead and read that real quick. And here's the picture. And they're actually pretty big. Way bigger than my dog. Oh, bella, 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 bella. Gotcha. Yeah. So, um, let's continue with the book. Alright. The Boogeyman. This is horrifying. Okay. It's bigger than the average human size. And here's the story. Alright. And then here's the picture. The chupacabra. Come look at this. Okay. Um. Okay. So this is the chupacabra. It's pretty scary. Okay. And here's the story. And here's the picture of it eating a goat. And it's probably bigger than the human. The Gogmagog. So, yeah, this is a Gogmagog. These are back in, like, um, Greece. I, have, I don't really know. Ancient Greece times. Here's the story. Alright, and then here's them fighting these Gogmagogs. And they're way bigger than the average human size. And, yeah. Alright, the Golem. Alright, so this is a Golem. <laughs> Pretty scary, actually. Uh, here's the story. Alright, well, here's the picture. And they're actually bigger than the average human. Now, the Leviathan. This is a giant fish creature. Here's the story. And here is the size. They're a lot bigger than the average human size. Well, you, uh, maybe if you want to take a look at the picture real quick. You see you got the Leviathan in the background. Sorry if I can hear that. Mer people. So this is basically a mermaid, but it's evil. Here's the story. Okay. And then here's the picture. And here's the size of the mer... mer people. The mummy. Alright, the mummy. Well, let me give y'all a quick glimpse at this thing. It's pretty horrifying. Alright. Uh, I'd say it's a, a bit, a bit taller than the average human. Here's the story. It's a really good one. I really like this one. And here's the story. I mean, the, the um, picture. Alright. The Tokalisha. Alright. Here's the story. And here's the picture. Right. And they're smaller than the average human. Troll. Alright, this is a troll. 
here's the story of this troll taking a baby and leaving her baby here. And then here is the size, it's bigger than the average human. So look, the basilisk. Alright, this is like a giant chicken creature. Alright, here's the story. And here's the picture. And they're a lot bigger than the human. Serpris. This is a three-headed dog with a bunch of snakes. All right, and they're about the size of my dog. And here's the story. All right, the Chimera. This is basically a lion with a snake tail and a goat on its back. It's basically the size of a lion. And here is a picture of this man defeating this mighty beast. And here's the story. Alright. Here's the Cyclops. He, always looked the, he looks a bit different than I imagined. And here's the story. And here's the picture. And bigger than the average human size. Fenrir. I really like Fenrir. Alright. Here's the story. And here's the picture. And he's six miles, which is ten kilometers. The Gorgon. This is one of Medusa's sisters. I think there's another one in this book. Alright, story. Picture. Here you go. Just turning all these people into stone. I think there's another one in the background. And then there's the actual size. They're not very big compared to humans. The griffin. Alright. Have a look at this. That's pretty scary. And then he's bigger than the human. Here's a picture of them attacking this horse. And then here's the story. Harpy. These things, let me just say, these things are ugly. And look at that. It's pretty ugly to me. Here's the picture of them taking all this king's food. And here's the story. Alright, here is their actual size. That's pretty much it. Alright, the Hydra. Alright, so the Hydra. It's a snake with a bunch of heads. I don't I'm trying to count all the heads, but I can't. Here's the story of him. Of this Hydra. And then here's the picture. Alright, here is the actual size of the Hydra. It's about I think bigger in width than the human, not length. Kraken. This is a three-headed octopus. It is 0 0.6 miles, which is one kilometer. And here's a picture of the ship. And then the Kraken comes and just eats the ship. And look at this guy. He's like, help me. And here's the story. Right. <coughs> the Manticore. This is basically a lion with a man's face. Here is their actual size. They're not very big. And then here is the story. All right, and the picture. The Minotaur. Minotaur, Minotaur. All right, they're bigger than the average human. And here are the stories. Pause and read this one. And this one. And this one. All right. So here is the pictures. Right. And Oni. Alright. This is basically a goblin. And here's the story. 
and here's the picture of him terrorizing this village. And there's their actual size. They're pretty close to the average human size. Here's the rock. This is a giant eagle. Did I skip the page one up? No, I didn't. Yeah, that's the, that's the rock for you, a giant eagle. Alright, now here's the story. Here's the picture. And they're pretty big compared to the average human. Scylla. Scylla. I don't know how to say that. Scylla? Okay, but this is another one of the Medusa sisters. But you can probably tell already. And here's the story. And here's the picture. And then they are, she is 328 feet, which is 100 meters. Sphinx. This is basically a hybrid of a snake, a human, and, I don't know, a panther, a mountain lion. <coughs> I don't know. Alright, here's the story. Man, my hand hurts. Here's the story, y'all. And there's the picture. And there's the actual size. Wait. Here's a Thunderbird. This is a bigger eagle. It has two heads. Here's the story. And just so you'll understand how big this thing is, here's a picture of it picking up a whale. Sorry about the check in the camera. Three miles. That's how big they are. Which is five kilometers. Right. Wyvern. This is for my dragon lovers. Alright, Wyvern. He's a dragon. He's a giant dragon. Alright, there's the actual size. He's not very big compared to other dragons. And here's a picture of him. I don't really know. Here's the story. So you'll probably understand the picture. Right. Now I just gotta say, all these um, illustrations are really good. Alright, Dracula. Alright, here's Dracula. And here's, their, here's his actual size. And here is the story. If you go ahead, if you want to read that, go ahead and pause it. And here is, I believe, I don't know. But someone's killing Dracula. Yeah. Right. Frankenstein's monster. This is a monster. It's Frankenstein. Here's his actual size. He is actually bigger than the average human. And here's the picture. No, I think I don't think it has a story. Doesn't but I'll just show you this just in case if you want to go ahead and read that. Gargantua. Okay, so this is basically a giant. He eats people here. That's a, I think that's a dog. Or bunny. I don't know. Alright, now here's his actual size. He's 328 feet, which is 100 meters. And here's the story. It's a really good one. I like this story. Alright, here's the picture of him eating these helpless pilgrims. Godzilla. Here's Godzilla. Alright, this is Godzilla right here. And here's his actual size. So you'll finally know he's actually 300 feet. Which is like, what? I think 91 meters? Yeah. Here's the story. Alright, yeah, here's the picture. King Kong. I like King Kong. So it's a giant monkey or gorilla, I'm not sure. Alright, here's the story. Here's the picture. Here's the actual size. He is 50 feet and 15 meters. Well, well he's 50 feet, which is 15 meters. Here's Mothra, the giant moth. Here's the story. Here's the picture. Alright, so she is 
396 feet, which is 140 meters. Okay, a werewolf. All right, so this is the werewolf. Here's the story. Right, and here's the size. Here's the pictures. This man turning into a werewolf. Bigfoot. All right, this is one of the most no most known and most popular cases. A lot of people think Bigfoot Bigfoot's real. All right, here is his actual size, and here are his like brothers, the Yeti, the Ja. I don't know how to say that. And the Alma. The Gray Alien. Alright, and it's like E.T., see? Put your finger there. Alright, there's the Gray Alien, and here's the story. And here's this man over here. With all these aliens um, searching in. And here's their actual size. Hopskinville Goblin. Alright, so this is basically a goblin. And it's pretty scary, actually. Um, here's the picture of this man with this goblin. And then here's the story real quick. You can probably see both of them. Go ahead. Alright. Oh, my arm hurts. Alright, here's the size. That's pretty much it. We're getting close to the end. The Jersey Devil from New Jersey. Alright. I never actually knew what this thing looked up looked like up close. Here is the size. Here's the story. And here is the dirty devil. In the picture. Lock this monster. It's a giant sea monster. There's the lock this monster. Here are the two stories. Number one. Number two. And number three. And then here are his, like, brothers, I guess. Here's the actual size. And then that's pretty much it. Here's Mothman. He's pretty cool, I guess. Alright. Here's Mothman. Here's the picture. Here's the story. I'm gonna read that. Alright, and then here's their actual size. Reptoid alien. So this is another alien. <coughs> <coughs> Just like the legends, this one actually abducts cows. And then brings them back on Earth after he's eaten them. I think they take their organs. All right, here's the reptoid alien. There's their size. And here's the story. There's another story. Hang on, sorry. Here's a story up here. And here's the other story. I... One. Yeti is one of um, Bigfoot's brothers. Alright, so here's their actual size. And then there's the picture. And here's the story. See, this guy's like, he's teasing this man. The last page. Here's the Yowie. This is pretty scary. Alright, that's what a Yowie looks like if you were wondering. Alright, morning dog lovers. Here's this dog barking at this yaoi. And then I guess the yaoi ate the dog. This woman's like, oh no. Alright, there's the actual size of the yaoi. And here's the story. Sorry if you can hear my dog barking in the background. There's the story, y'all. And that's the end. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this Mythical Monsters book review. If you want more like this, give this video to 10 likes. Bye, guys.